morning, you've got time for a hot, home-cooked breakfast. Delicious and piping hot in only three microwave minutes. Are you kidding? Yo, pretty packages of frosted delights. Look, it comes with a toy. <laughs> I like that. I want a number four, number six, and throw in a plastic donut. Just enjoy the gritty crunch. It tastes just, just like, like chicken. chicken. Wrappers of many bite sizes. Man, are you freaking blind? It's a rock. All mixed in the pot full. Mama's homemade from scratch. Well, not, not quite. quite. Toasted over flames, they be tasting <laughs> quite, quite right. right. All hell King Neptune and his water breathers. No snail thing too quick for his water feeders. Don't, Don't waste, waste time. time with your net. Our net worth is set. Ready, go. Many no others. But we be the colors of the mad and the wicked. We be bad, we be brick it with the 24-hour sign. Shower mind habits while you dine like rabbits with the crunchy, crunchy carrots. Oh, Gotta have it super fast. The whole line of breakfast you've got time for. Super fast, super fast, a criminal's just in time for breakfast. Keep it true, keep it true, forever blue. The night, the night, throws out just luminum. A crucial fun, aluminum. The sea is reactive. The sea is reactive. Oh, hell, King Neptune and his water breathers. No snail thing too quick for his water feeders. Don't waste time with your net. Our net worth is set. Ready, go. Many no others. What? We be the colors of the mad and the wicked. We be bad. We be bricking with the 24-hour sign. Shower mind habits while you dine like rabbits with the crunchy, crunchy carrots. Oh, that's true. Gotta have it super fast. Super fast, super fast. I come last. But just in time for breakfast. Keep it true. Hello, welcome to another stream guys. Sorry I wasn't able to do anything, uh, I think it was yesterday night. I had a really bad migraine. I actually did want to stream, but it just it didn't turn out that way. So unfortunately I couldn't do anything then. Um, today I had a really busy day, but I still want to stream. It just probably won't be as long as two hours, maybe more like an hour. And I'm also not sure how much is left of the game. So, I know it's not a huge game, it's nothing compared to Undertale size, but I imagine that there's going to be at least half an hour to an hour left, but yeah, I'm not sure. Anyways, let's get into it and see what is happening. Whoop. Okay. Okay, so to remind ourselves of where we were, we had sort of arrived at the castle which belongs to one of the kings which is Lance's dad and now we've joined up with everybody except for Lancer um, and I believe that we are at the place where his dad hangs out but I'm not sure it just kind of looks that way it's a throne it seems to have been damaged in a struggle so we know that Lance's dad one of the kings there were three other kings and he well he's locked them up there in that little circus freak trailer downstairs but there was obviously some sort of problem that they had there oh yeah i can walk fast i keep forgetting okay that's the same as the others we've got all spades here wall banners also through some sort of struggle we haven't met lance's dad yet we know of him but that's all there is. Let's run down this corridor. Okie dokie. <laughs> hey, there's Lancer. <laughs> Father! <laughs> Lancer, my son. Have you dispatched the lightners as I commanded? Mm, no, but... I did even better. It turns out we don't actually have to fight them. They said they could just talk to you, and they're alive? Yes, and I think you'll like them a lot. There's Susie, she's very purple and strong, and 
Where are they now? Um, here, <laughs> right here. Hey, it's nice to meet you. Lancer, Lancer, my son. Yes, father? Father? Do you remember what I told you? Don't get too attached. You have failed. <gasps> they have poisoned you with their sentimentality. Free yourself, Lancer. They care not for you. Their only goal is to destroy our glorious fountain. They are scum. They haven't even spoken to us. No, they aren't. What did you say? Oh my gosh, brutal. Let him go. You want me to let him go? Then how about this? Don't throw him over the cliff. Please don't do that. I'll drop him off the edge and let him splatter. That's your own son. That's... That's brutal. Unless you all kneel and learn your place. What will it be, Lightness? This got really intense really quickly. Don't... Don't listen to him, Susie. Heal. Heal. Oh. Now watch, Lancer. See what happens when you befriend Lightness. What the? You, you traitor! Come back here! Alright, enough already. Who the hell do you think you are? <laughs> Creepy laughing that I'm not gonna read. To my people, I am a hero. To you? That's, that's worse than anything I could ever expect. <laughs> I'm the bad guy. I don't even want to talk about what's going on in the torso. Mm. Oh no, epic battle. Um, King. Okay, all we can do is just talk. Um, I might try Ralsei talking. Uh, oh, that's right. Maybe I should have told Susie to talk. Susie's got magic? I wasn't aware of that. Um, I guess I'll get Susie to defend? Ralsei tried to reason with the king. You might not realize it, but this is a world where you don't have to fight. I know if we try, we can all find another way. Such simple-minded platitudes. Shame you will not live to realize your naivety. Now, perish with the pathetic lightness you worship. Sorry, my friends and I aren't going anywhere. Ralsei's will is changing. Talk became dual heal. Okay, I guess that's cool. How dare you come here, lightness. Okay, this is where I'm gonna fail. Just heads up. Oh. Ugh. I'm so bad at these. Okay, the battlefield is rumbling. I'm gonna continue to act. Okay, so she can do that, but she probably needs TP to do that. It's kind of scary that that's become an option, because it probably means that I'm gonna have to use it, which means that I'm gonna probably die, or come close to dying anyways. Let's get Susie to talk. Uh, might as well get Ralsei to defend. Get some TP. Susie tried to reason with the king. All right, listen up. Lance is my friend, so if we can get by without hurting you, then... If I perish, so be it. Show my son the monster you really are. That's pretty good logic. All right, you want to see what I can do, huh? Susie's will is changing. Talk became Red Buster. Okay, I don't know what that is. You, that left us in the shadows, stripped of meaning. Whoa. What the? Yeah. Uh. Damage, taking all the damage, that's me. Battlefield still rumbling. I'm gonna do a talk this time. Uh, can you do any magic? Mm, 
I don't know what this is. Let's try it. Um, you can defend to get more TP back. You try to reason with the king. Silence, Lightbringer. Your very existence goes against our own. By the knight's will, I shall shatter your heart to pieces. Your will is changing. Ooh. Talk became courage. It's kind of like every time we talk to him, we're getting a cool upgrade, but so far I don't know what any of them do, but we'll find out about Susie's now. Okay. Rude Buster, that's just fighting, I guess. You dare return to torment us once again. Whee okay, that's the easiest one so far. Oh wait, I still took damage. Typical. Darkness pours from the fountain. Alright, I've got courage. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on a second. Courage costs money. No, it gives a defense boost. Okay, no, costs money. <laughs> Never mind. Uh, you can defend. You can defend too, just so we get some TP. You encourage the party. The party's defense raised for this turn. Okay, be gone. We have found fresh purpose. Eee! Man, I am really not good at this. Ooh, Rousey took some damage. Okay. Let me see now. I've got courage again, that's... Okay, that costs money, which we don't have yet. That also costs money. Um, maybe I will defend. And then you... Wait, no, I don't know what yours does yet. I'll defend. Susie can defend, and then I want to see... Rousey can't really do anything, huh? Okay, hold on. You can do this. And you can defend. How about that? So that's... Yeah, I don't know if that's going to be effective. I think we might have to talk to him. Well, the knight has appeared. Ooh. I do not like this one. At all. King's mouths gave a berserk. Oh, he does have more than one mouth. Creepy. Okay, courage takes money. I haven't done red buster yet. What's that? Or did I do that? No, I did rude buster. I'm so confused. Um, I guess I'll do that. And then if you guys both defend again, we'll get some more TP. Party Spence, the knight that pulls the fountains from the earth. Ooh, this is red now. <gasps> uh, really not good at this. Man, that's difficult. Okay, so I don't have 60 yet for Susie, but if I do this, then... No, that's not what I want to do. Ugh! Hmm. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to be doing here. Act. She can do that. Might as well do that. Um, and then if you guys both defend, your soul shined its power on Ralsei. Ralsei cast Jewel Heal. Awesome, so they gain quite a bit. Hmm. Ah, this is my least favorite one. <laughs> oh man. I thought this one was easy, but it's not. Who do we have here? We've got Car. Thank you for joining in. And Kerps. Thank you guys for hitting up the stream. That's amazing. Have your support. Hopefully, you guys can help me with this battle because I have no idea what I'm doing. It's not as easy. Maybe I should check the king. You know, I haven't done that yet. It could give me some interesting information. I don't know. You can defend. What can you do? Heal prayer. Mm. You know what? You can defend as well. Okay, king. Abandoned by the lightness, his heart became cracked with hatred. 
cannot be reasoned with, but don't give up. Okay, so that's probably why they got rid of the talking thing. Whoa! Oh man, I'm really terrible at this. At least I have heaps of TP. <laughs> um, I don't have magic. Jewel heal heals everybody, costs 50 TP, red damage, let's try that because I feel like I actually haven't done that yet, I'm not sure but, your soul shined its power on Susie, Susie used red buster, oh that's epic, okay yeah we have not used that before, soon this world should be blanketed in darkness and darkness shall rule it, okay, we've got things going very fast. I swear the battle scenes in Deltarune are way harder than they were in Undertale. I don't remember struggling this much. I remember that I could play it and not take damage in one turn but this way it's just I, I'm always taking damage so I don't know. I'm gonna get you to defend. Actually no. Oh, I can't do dual heal yet. Um, choose courage. And then... You can defend. Can you use anything? You can do a heal prayer. We have just enough. Um, you can heal Susie, I think. You encourage the party. The party's defense raised. Oh, I do have food that I can feed them. I should have done that. Forgot about that. No. My least favourite. Okay, whatever. Oh no, Ralsei's down! Um. Oh gosh darn it. Do I have any cool items? I have a revive mint. I'm going to use that on... Ralsei. You've got normal fighting abilities. I don't know why I did that. That was an accident, but whatever. That's very minimal damage, normal fighting. Okay, now enough talk. Fall before the chain of justice. Man, not this one again. <gasps> no ways. This is incredibly difficult. What? Whatever. Um, I've only got 39. I'm just gonna go on a defend spree. Oh, you can't do anything. Let me give an item to you. You can eat that. Uh, you can't really use much at the moment. I'll get you to defend too. Just get some people's HP up, I think. Haha, you're quite strong, aren't you? Oh my gosh. Things getting faster. I think we just have to keep going. I think that's what the check said, is just don't give up. I think that'll work out. Okay, I've got some cool stuff now. I'm gonna go for that one because it's epic. Um, mm, you don't really have anything cool, but I wanna use that on Susie. I almost said sushi on, S on Susie. Susie used Red Buster. Took a heap of damage, that's good. 300 is more than last time. Ralsei used the Dark Burger. If I keep fighting you like this, then... Then what? Then we'll win? Ooh. Oh man. Okay, my health is... Okay. Uh, I might as well defend, I think. Susie is taking epic damage, to be honest. Can you do anything? Not really. Um, I've got another one, so I'm, I am going to give it to Susie because she basically just took so much damage just then. And you can defend two, and then that should mean that for the next turn, we'll... No, we'll be able to do it the next turn? Maybe, the, I don't know. I think I need 60 TP for the move that I want to do. Alright. Okay, it wasn't too bad. 
Oh, it's got 65 now. Epic. I'm going to use this one. Uh, you can't do anything because we don't have any magic. Hmm. After this epic boss battle... Oh, sorry. Am I missing the chat? Uh, today, thank you. No! <laughs> thank you for watching today. I totally forgot that I even told you about this. Uh, okay, yeah, I did put the song in the description. I'm going to try and remember to do that um, at the beginning of every stream. And make sure that I stick with the, stop, with the song that I write down. My knight, I shall not fail you. I don't know who he's talking about. Because it sounds like he's talking about himself. That was one of his first attacks. Okay. Yeah, this is kind of weird. He looks like Garfield. <laughs> like a blue Garfield. Enough is enough. I see. I see that I cannot defeat you. I have grown exhausted from our long battle. It wasn't It really wasn't that long. We've had much more epic battles in Undertale, but... This is like Undertale Light. Just as he says, Lightness. Lightness, I... Perhaps I have been too cruel. The truth is, I was not always this way. There once was a time where darkness and lightness lived in harmony. A time where darkness could fulfill their purpose in peace. It would be a lie to say that I, too, do not yearn for those days. My heart, my soul. Perhaps you young ones are right. Please, let us put away our weapons. Trick, don't believe, fake, fake news. There must be a peaceful solution to all this. This guy is totally trolling. It's not going to happen. He just wants us to do exactly what we are apparently doing. And no, don't. Okay. Ralsei says that we should do it, but I... No, he's evil. No. He's going to kill us all right now, I swear. None of us really want to fight. If you can just tell us about your worries, I'm sure we can all be friends, Mr. King. This is not going to happen. This is... I don't know, maybe I'm too cynical, but I really think that this is, this is not how it's going to work out. That sounds lovely. Cough. My apologies. I am... I'm not used to fighting like that. Is this guy going to die? My body is getting weak. Oh, don't say another word. Is this a trap? Doesn't look like it worked, Ralsei. I told you! I told you this was a trap. Are you kidding? Is this like part two of the battle now? Is that what we're gonna do? You. Did I say you could get up? Hey, how epic am I? Look at my cool shield. That was such a Zelda noise just then as well. Chris? Oh, spare me the heroics. I'm dying. Fat Garfield's gonna come eat me with his tummy. I'm not lasagna. You, you're the leader, aren't you? So what's your plan? To laugh as you cast us all back into obscurity? You can't even say? Well, I don't talk. I don't know if you've been watching this, but... Young one, let me tell you a secret. Is he gonna eat me? What? Quiet people piss me off. That's what Susie said to me at the very beginning in the hallway. It's kind of weird. Are we gonna f- no. Hey! She looks like David Bowie. Get away from my friend. <laughs> or what? Surely you must realize how exhausted I am, Lightner. Any hit from you would kill me. Why not do it, Lightner? Kill me and show my son how much you really care. <laughs> nah. What are you gonna do, Susie? 
So what's your plan then? To talk me to death? He's getting closer. You stupid, stupid Leitner. You honestly think you have any way to convince me not to kill you? Just wait a second. Wait for what? What's happening? Huh? Why am I suddenly so sleepy? <gasps> Ralsei! Why you, you little, you sweet little <laughs> pumpkin. <laughs> oh, Susie doesn't know how to do that. That must have been Ralsei. He looks so cute. Look at him sleeping. Is his other mouth asleep? <laughs> or just the top one? Hey, Chris, you all right? That was close, Susie. I'm surprised you remembered my pacify spell. Okay, so she obviously taught it to her. Hey, come on. I'd never forget something that I made fun of you for. <laughs> nice. Chris, Susie, I'm sorry. Because I healed the king, we almost... We almost... Susie, you were right. I, I was foolish to think we could act so soft to everyone. This isn't a world where kindness always wins, is it? Nah, <laughs> it's complicated. Yeah, sometimes there's people you just gotta fight. But if you never let your guard down, then... Hey, look, it's Lancer. <laughs> you might just hurt someone you care about, too. Everyone, we have an announcement to make. You're okay. Lancer, hey! Sorry, I kind of beat up your dad. That's okay. It happens. Oh, it even looks like he's having a beauty nap. That's good. He seemed cranky. <laughs> so naive. Man, you can say that again. What is going on? Uh, Lancer? What is that noise? Oh, I actually came to warn you clownlings. I informed the guys you were fighting my dad, but instead of eagerly volunteering to help you, everyone just caught the freakouts. Now they appear to be, um, breaking through the door to the throne room. Well, uh, that's not the best. Why are they breaking through? Chris, Susie, it seems that you must hurry to the fountain. No time for goodbyes, huh? Yes, of course, no goodbyes. We're bad guys, so we only have bad buys. Cringe. Haha, <laughs> you've learned a lot, huh? Only from the best of the worst. <laughs> That's cute. Okay, I'll go stop the door. Later, dude. So now we're gonna split up. It's just gonna be me and Susie. Susie, Chris, if we must say goodbye, then, um, I, I just wanted to say I, I, I really enjoyed meeting you two, and, hey, can you stop mumbling into your hat for a sec? I can barely hear you, dude. Oh, I'm sorry. <gasps> what? That's weird. Looks just like theme Bob. Um, Chris, Susie, I I hope I can see you again soon. Is this my brother? I'm so confused. Next time I'll make you lots of yummy cakes, alright? Cause this is a dude, right? Could be my it looks like my brother. I'm so confused. So Susie. <laughs> Um, yeah, sure, dude. Ha ha. Let's go, Chris. Okay, bye. Cute little goat man. Oh, we're on another adventure. Sweet. So that was interesting. We had the fountain already. Ooh. Look at this. It's amazing. Is this the fountain? Don't know how, but feels like we stumbled into something really important, didn't we?
Well, there's no time to think about that now. Right now. It's time to go home. Right, Chris? I guess. Yeah, Ralsei's a goat. Who cares about whether Ralsei is a guy or a girl? <laughs> Gasp, Ralsei's a goat? <laughs> As you stood in front of the fountain, you felt something strange. It was as if your very soul was glowing. My heart. My heart, my soul. It's pretty cool music, I like it. It is the end. Maybe we have no. We have to come out of the closet first. I mean, the su the supply closet. Come out of the supply closet. What what happened? I can't see anything. <laughs> hey, watch it. I knew it. Huh? The unused classroom. How do we get here? I completely forgot what Sizzy looks like, and even myself, without our cool adventure gear on. I mean, I look like I have jaundice. Hey, Chris. What just happened? Like, that wasn't a dream or anything, was it? The end makes you poop yourself. <laughs> Don't say that, Twenty. <laughs> anyway, as I was saying... Let's just tell Alphys we couldn't find any chalk. But there's so much cool stuff in this room. Look. This looks like a Pokemon toy. It's a worn down, stuffed animal. Oh, I'm so sad. It's a light switch. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, and this? Playing cards spill out of a deck in the closet. That makes some sense because we have been playing around in this game world. There are pawns strewn on it. I mean, what about this door? Can I... The door is locked. Okay, fair enough. What about this weird green poster? Can I look at that individually? It's a yellowed, poorly drawn picture of a green turtle. It's signed, Alvin. That's cute, I guess. Okay, we're out. Man, the sun's already setting. Everyone else must have gone home by now. I guess Alphys will know better than to ask us next time, huh? I'm digging these bird noises. I'm wondering what kind of birds they are. Really pretty. Well, that's where we came in. Well, I guess we should go. <laughs> See you later, I guess. What? With the friends. <laughs> Side eye. Chris? Wet. Pet, pet. Let's go back there tomorrow, alright? Can we do that? I mean, I don't have a power to open a portal in a closet. Maybe she does. The door is locked. Can I go straight back in there now? The door is locked. Okay, I think the classroom is this way. Can I look at any of these? The locker is locked. Everything is flippin' locked, isn't it? Oh, let's look at Alphys' stuff. Computer is turned off. Everything felt peaceful for a moment. It's a bunch of roses. It's a bee! There's a bee in my room. How oh, dare you spray a bee? Save the bees! Looks like motivational quotes from various literature. Try your best, Astral Wolf, even in your darkest hour. That one seems to be from a video game. Can I look in people's desks? No. Okay, that's boring. Bees are pretty stoic. I think it'll. It's gonna stay alive, kicking and screaming for for a while. <laughs> Are you ready for the Sadie Hawkman's dance? At this dance, all the chaperones wear giant hawk heads and screech at any students that make contact while dancing. 
Okay, what's this? Fountain. You ran the water fountain. It's lukewarm. I'm just looking at everything I can. Do you like breathing? Moving fast? With or without legs? But usually with legs? Join the cross-country team with Jockington and Noel. No thanks. Oh, I, I can go in here now. I told you Toriel was a teacher. Look, this is her classroom. This is Ms. Toriel, I guess. We should, um... Seems like it hasn't been erased in a very long time. It's a computer there. It's desktop wallpaper is you and your brother dressed up for Halloween eight years ago. Yeah, I got a brother. I don't know if you guys... Yeah, poor bee, am I right? Save the bees. Don't spray the bees. Could have, I could have, I could have saved the bee. Kids' books. Some of them used to be yours. The throne of the gods. That's just chairs, right? This is a baby classroom. I mean, it's not going to be like potties. Some kind of primitive sculpture. Who knows what it represents? I'm not going to take a guess at that. <laughs> I don't know. Oop, I'm ringing. Chris? Whatever have you been doing? sat in the car waiting for you after school for half an hour. I called and called, but you never picked up. You had your poor mother worried sick. Chris, I'm afraid I'm going to have to punish you. No cake. Huh? A friend? You were spending time with... A friend? <laughs> Unbelievable. Chris, I will make an exception this time. You can continue your adventures a little longer. But when you return home, you are going to have to go to bed early. See you soon, honey. Eek. That's pretty cute. We've got some new people in chat. Steven, Allison. Hey guys, thanks for joining. It's almost finished though. <laughs> well, I think the game's almost finished. I actually have no idea, so we'll just have to see. I mean, I was hanging out with my friend. I don't know where Susie went. Um, I guess I'm just gonna walk home. Can I? Oh, I can go in all these places. That's pretty neat. Hey, it's this annoying man dark guy. Chris, you survived Susie. I was getting worried. Now you can finally pay off your family debt. How to draw dragons. <laughs> However, Chris, I am a benevolent volunteer assistant. If you turn it in this week, I'll reduce your fine to a mere 64 bucks. Consider it, Chris. How about no? There's a book here. You lick the page. It's delicious. This must be what they meant by flavor text. Mm. I am a weird one. Chris, what's up? Caddy's working, so I'm starting on our project. I've already copied a bunch of pictures. It's the same picture of a soccer ball 73 times. Alright, whatever floats your boat, buddy. Temmy. Gotta go to college. So Tem stubby. Hard. She's reading a comic full of hot demon guys. Okay. There's an anime review. Read it. Ah, uh, yes. Teens Corner Monthly Toon Review. Mew Mew Kissy Kitty 2. Right, right. This reviewer had Mew Mew 2 as her first exposure to the series, it sounds like Alphys, and let her tell you it makes Mew Mew 1 look like a dumpster with sparkly cat ears. With a darker storyline and more mature themes, the second one treats the viewer like a real adult, instead of like an animal that will die if it goes 10 seconds without seeing a beach ball. Not to mention, Mew Mew's character in the first one is more stale, ouch, than the ramen I eat at home by myself with the lights off. Teens and older should check out this dark masterpiece. Signed the anonymous yellow lizard Alphys. Yeah, obviously. Yeah, sorry guys, thank you for joining the stream. I have no idea what I'm doing right now. This is obviously not part of the storyline, but we'll see what happens. I love reading books, especially the books upstairs. You should really read them. Um. You know, I'd love to if you would allow me up the stairs, but your fat ass is in the way. You look through the window to the computer lab. There seems to be a dog inside working at a computer. 
Seems like it's making a game. Seems like you shouldn't interrupt it. Seems like when the game's finished, you can go in. Okay, you just have to trust the dog. Okay, that's obviously Toby Fox telling us that when the game is finished, we will be able to go into that section of said game. Hey, it's Undyne! Hey, punk, get out of the road. You're blocking traffic. Oh, wait, it's just Asgore's kid. Just me. You know, it's not like I gave you a new life and everything. Sorry, I'm a little, uh, worked up lately. This job is so boring. Nothing ever happens in this town. I just wish something would shake things up. Huh? You got something to report? Uh... Nothing. <laughs> Don't do anything illegal, you little punk. And let me know if you get a lead on any purple girls. There's one wanted on several counts of comic mischief. Really? You think she'd understand though, I mean, I think Susie is a lot like Undyne. How am I supposed to get past this blue lady? I'm stuck. I guess I should just run away. Okay. Oh look, there's a tiny little green man in this car. Police Chief Undyne is supposed to be directing traffic, but all she's doing is standing in the middle of the street yelling, get out of my way. She's the best, huh? I feel really directed. Okay, there's a way to like, ah, I don't know, let's look at the hospital. Okay. I remember these toys. I used to play with these. Yeah, it's one of those sliding bead toys that naturally spawns inside doctor's offices, yeah. The beads march grimly along their set path. Okay. Oh, it's you. Are you here to play the piano again? I did play the piano in Undertale. The patients can't hear it well from here, but I personally enjoy it. I don't know if I remember how to play the piano. Okay, as a result, it's missing most of the good keys. Play it? Sure. <laughs> that sounded bad. Uh, can I- oh, I can? Okay, wow. Hmm, even more wow. Let's talk to this guy, called Pain. Oh, that's a pain chart. This castle's white wizards relegated me to this healing chamber, but my blood is boiling for battle. Okay. You look inside the cupboard. A very small obligatory piano is hiding inside. Alrighty, alrighty. Undyne doesn't have her eye patch. This is true. But I mean, I think if you want to work in any kind of law enforcement, you have to have 2020, right? I think, I think so. I don't know. Ah ha ha ha, dad. I can't just say that to her. Oh my god, I die. I would literally die, she says to her dad, sitting in the hospital bed. Probably literally dying. Noelle, sweetheart. First time I laid eyes on your mother, I walked right up and told her she was a hot piece of work. Really? Yeah, she slapped me so hard I blacked out. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> dad, that doesn't help at all. Anyhow, how's Dragon Blazes 3? Beat it yet? Nah, I'm still at the Ice Palace. I've been kind of... Kind of waiting to finish it with you, Dad. Noelle. Maybe... Maybe you shouldn't wait. Oh, this is so deep. Dad? You should bring it here. I'm bored as hell. <laughs> okay, fine, you win. I'll bring it next time. Oh, it's getting late. Guess I better go. I've got homework. Oh, that's the group project voice. Bird guy again? What's his name? Nerdly? It's, um, Birdly. He's not that bad, Dad. I'll kick his ass. <laughs> Dad, you're not even supposed to get up. Bring him by the window, I'll throw something at him. Goodbye, Dad. Bye, honey. That's cute. Oh. Hi, Chris. She's not like, why are you coming to see my dad in the hospital? It's not weird at all. Well, jingle my gosh darn bells. Looks like Christmas came early. That pun only works if you see it written out. Alright, Chris. Just give me the straight shot. Why are you here? Did your mum make you come here? No. Really? You've grown up a lot, Chris. I'm proud of you. Wasn't too long ago 
You were just the creepy kid next door. Now you're the creepy kid right in front of me. This guy's a douche. Okay, okay, seriously, you wanna chat or something? Um... Ask about your illness. I don't know, is it too personal? I'm not sure. So, why am I here? Well, they found some crap. So it's just some tests. Yeah, it's no big deal. Nothing a holiday can't handle. I'll be out of here in a jiff. Then I can go back to... I don't know. Yelling at you for getting tangled in our light display. Okay. What else can we talk to him about? Family? Chris, even if we've grown apart, we still love your family. After all, me and Asgore, Asgore were college pals, right? Oh hey, now that Azrael's off to college, you think he's doing any crazy parties like me and your dad? I'm just pulling your leg. Your dad was no party animal. Your mother, on the other hand, <laughs> unlikely. She'd always fuss about going, but once the party started, yikes, man. Once she hit me clear across the room with a key lime pie, I got smashed into the snack table and toppled everything. Tasty pie, though. Couldn't complain. That's pretty cute. Let's have a look-see at this. It's a bunch of roses in a glass container. Hey, I'm happy your dad brought me flowers, but... Roses? What is this, man? Beauty and the Beast? That ain't gonna work, man. We're both beasts. Okay, see you later, bye. Very strange. There's so much extra stuff that we can do. So, I mean, what's down this away? We've got a church with a creepy dude out the front. Chris, what a pleasant surprise to see you here. And on a school day. There must be a reason that you came here at such a time. I, Father Alvin, implore you. If you have anything weighing on your mind, please speak. This was the turtle drawing. Um, in the supply closet? They said it was a weird green turtle. Um, called Alvin. Fruit juice. Chris, if you want some of our sick fruit juice, you should come to our service. Our choir sings don't ring any bells to me. I'm not remembering any of that. What's this? Nothing? Okay. And down here? Whoa! Mm. This is interesting. Is this endless? Oh, okay. Never mind. I thought that might be something Toby Fox would do. It's locked. Really? But it's so spooky and cool down here. There's nothing that I can do? Probably not yet. I mean, this game isn't finished. I think I... I think I mentioned that at the start. It's kind of like a demo, but then it's longer than a demo. I don't know if there's a word for that. Well, let's go and check out everybody. Hey, short stuff. Why would you possibly need to talk to the mayor? Your allowance too low? Ate too much candies? Too many candies. Lost your frisbee in the wash? Hey, short stuff. That's what the cops are for. Okay. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. The mayor is busy right now. If you need to see her, please try causing some terrible crisis. Cool advice. The mayor's charisma is about zero. No, it's negative. But she works hard and has a good track record, so she runs unopposed. That's politics, rarely. Okay, I'm not sure who the mayor is. Can't really think of anybody at the moment. Let's go up. So much to look at. Hey, look at Sans! Okay, well, we can go look at him soon. Wow, this is really long. It's gonna take some time. Oh, you're lucky, Chris. You got to miss class with Alphys. It's not fair. If I skipped class, my dad would never let me hear the end of it. That's actually not even remotely funny. This is my buddy. I know him. Yo, Chris, you survived Susie. I mean, I never saw her beat anyone up, but uh, I'd be careful. Like, one time me, Snowy, and Jockington were playing handball, and she just kept creepily watching us from the corner. Then when the ball rolled over to her, she just, uh froze solid and kicked the ball back as hard as she could right into officer undyne's car then undyne came out 
smiling, cracked her knuckles, and totally wiped us at handball. Anyway, Susie sucks, Chris. Not very nice. Knack, knack, knack. Oi, Snowy, what did I tell you about knocking on the door so hard? Don't do it. It's really gonna hurt your face. We don't have arms. <laughs> okay, it's brutal. Well, I want to go see Sans. I imagine that these are all locked too. Oh, that sounds like the knock of a beginner. Come back when you've gotten better at knocking. What do you know? Knock, knock, knock. Ooh, are you the human that lives at the top of town? Wow, my mummy told me about you. Does it hurt to be made of blood? I guess it does. Wasn't this like... No. This is not my house, is it? I mean my old house. The distant... Oh, Papyrus' house. And Sands has got his own restaurant. Hey, look who's walking around. How are you, kid? Um, great to see you again. <laughs> I guess if you haven't played Undertale, then you would say who the hell are you. Yeah, it's real nice, isn't it? Especially considering I've never met you before. Right, the name's Sans. Sans the Skeleton. I'm new in town. What's up? Friends. We just moved here, so I hardly know anyone. Why, got anyone I should know better? Me. Whoa there, Tiger. You can't just jump straight into friendship. It takes time. Alright, that's enough time. Take this. Call it whenever you feel like. I got Sansa's number. I guess his restaurant, um... Are you busy tomorrow? I need some help with something. It'd be great if you could come over. I live just next door, you know. Yes. Wow, you answered quickly, huh? That's not good. I'm a total stranger. You should probably hesitate more. Well, guess I shouldn't complain, huh? What are we gonna be doing? Oh, I'm not gonna be there. That'd be weird. It's just gonna be you and my little brother. He needs friends. Thanks for hanging out with him. See ya. <laughs> okay. Looks like that's time to hang out with Papyrus. What's up here? Uh... This is weird, but okay. Oh, Chris! Chris, you're okay! I... I was really worried when you didn't come back. Where did you go? Did you skip class? Well, don't worry about it. I'm the cool teacher, you know. You're not in trouble. Well, let me know if you need anything. What are you doing? What is this? Oh, Chris. The... Did you want to talk about something? Yeah, what are you doing when I was chalk? Chris, even though you never got the chalk, you deserve an award for trying so hard to find it. So, in return, I can let you borrow... Um... My... My homemade DVD collection of The Symptoms. You know, the sitcom about the middle-class monster family. It's got every episode in all 28 seasons. It's the funniest, most quotable show ever. But make sure you don't... Whoa! seen this before. Oh, yeah, okay. Yep. One of my teachers was like this today. She just kept going. She kept going. She was like, I don't want to keep you guys for long. Maybe just, you know, half an hour and then two hours later. What's this? It's a saucer of milk. Okay. It's a trash can full of well-kept... Oh, those are flowers. I didn't know what they were. Well, we have looked at quite a- oh wait, this is huge, isn't it? Ooh. These are like furries. Oh god, someone's actually here. <laughs> Ice Ease Pizza. You're number one. Spot for a piping hot Pizza pizza. <laughs> hey, hey, wait a second. I recognize you. Oh, it's this guy. Little buddy, it's me! Wanna chat for a minute before I lose my mind? Uh, let's talk about my little brother. Do you know when Azzy's coming home? You can't tell him this, but I really miss the guy. It'd be sweet to cruise around town like the old times. Picking up, for example, chicks. <laughs> Which, as a matter of course, may not have ever actually happened. But one time, Undyne made eye contact with me. Yeah, that's not going anywhere. 
while she was writing me a speeding ticket. That is the best face. That is his best face. I love it. Oh, that's it. That's the end. Would you be interested in trying some of our many 24... I want to say Pezza. Pizza flavors. We've got normal, cheese, ice. Oh gosh. Gravy, double ice, pepperonis, and more. Oh, thank goodness. I thought he was going to literally list all of them. That would have been horrible. Oh, we going? We've got some more people in chat. Welcome, Gabriel. Thank you for tuning in. We're just going around at the moment, checking out the area. Because we've done, I guess, the main quest. And because the game's not finished yet, there's not really like a proper ending, so... I'm gonna go around and check everything out. Ice me up, ice me up, boss. Okay. Radio. The entrance is locked. No one's inside. Seems like all of the employees are outside in costume. Well, that's not gonna work out. This place also looks... Oh, it's open. Okay. <gasps> it's this guy. Oh, nice hat. Looking at my rugged body, you must wonder what kind of secrets I hold. My secret is, I put all my leftover pancakes in this giant hat. Okay, makes sense, I guess. Ice Wolf does not like ice in drink. Ice Wolf likes ice to be drink. Fair enough, fair enough. I remember you. So, for you two girls, that'll be the crepes, a cinnamon latte, two bunny parfaits, and a piece of firewood. Makes sense. I like the vibe of the waitresses here. Maybe I should sign up too. Nah, serving drinks wouldn't really suit a fire elemental. If I got nervous, I'd just melt all the ice. Mm, it seems plausible. Oh, this woman. You're alive. <laughs> nice. Okay, I'm working. I see that. Uh, we'll take the special and... Do you have any edible glitter? The youngest one won't eat anything if it doesn't look like treasure. <laughs> That's cute. Hey there, I haven't seen you in a while, hun. I remember, back on Sundays after service, you and your family would come in and order the special. Of course, things happened and then y'all stopped coming together. But every Sunday, you and your brother would still come in. He'd order you a hot chocolate and you two would sit down at that table in the corner, drawing shapes in the window with your breath. You must really miss him, huh? Here, how about this? Chris got the hot chocolate. Oh yeah! On the house. Thank you, lady. I wonder if he will make a feature in the game when they when they finish it. Because I think he's kind of important. Which way did I come from? Okay, yeah. What if I keep going up here? Oh my gosh, there's even more stuff. There's so much stuff. Where's my ghost friend? I would like to see him again. Oh, those guys! <gasps> those guys are my favorite! Hey, look, the ocean's kind of moving. Pretty neat. Maybe we brought these bros together. True. Nothing better than hanging at the lake with my best bro. Watching the waves go by. They were really cute. Just all the old characters. Ah, oh, maybe we'll see Dad. It's your Dad's truck. The floor of the front seat is littered with old papers and country CDs. Maybe he works here. Daddy! 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 Dum de dum. Oh, is someone there? Just a moment. I have almost finished watering these flowers. Here we are. It's me. Howdy, how can I... Oh, Chris! Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I forgot if you don't like hugs like that. Well now, make yourself at home, Chris. You can help yourself to anything you like. Anything? Anything? Well, I can't touch the flowers. It's a cash register. There's not much change. I'm not trying to loot the place. I'm just you know, trying to look at it. Ooh. He's conveniently joined me upstairs. I mean, is this is this how you live? 
dead. Yes, these flowers are still kicking. Quite hard to take care of them in this climate. It's pretty interesting. It's a green flower protected in a container. I suppose they're all going to say that. Yeah. Very, very interesting. And then this? It's locked up. Okay. Oh, I guess this is where my dad lives. Take all of his flowers. <laughs> I would if I could. I can't. There are various flowers inside. Yeah, it's just... I tried. Oh, bye, I guess. Chris, before you go... Here, for your mother. Our secret. You got the bouquet of flowers. Nice. Have a great day, Chris. Okay, I gotta take this to Mammy. Let's check out... Isn't this my ghost friend's house? I'm afraid no one's home right now. Why don't you go prance on home? I'm telling you, they're not home right now. Ah, uh, you just wanted to talk to me? My apologies, beautiful. I'm afraid I'm a bit of a nobody. What if I keep knocking? Okay, no, I think that's the end. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Chrissy, like, long time no see. What's up? Did you want to talk about something? Uh, go away. <laughs> Almost sister-in-law. I don't think so. Nah, I'm joking, but like... Remember that time I played Truth or Dare with Azzy? I like, made him give me his first kiss. <laughs> then your mom found out he kissed someone and like, I think she basically dialed 911. I swear your family went to church like every single day that week. <laughs> Okay. Scratching noise. There's so much to look at here. Hey, neighbor Baba. When's your brother Doug gonna come by? Yeah, I don't think that's his name. My girls would love to see him. He's a sweet little man. He's just got one problem. He doesn't like my wife's cooking. What's wrong, Douglas? You don't like frozen cat food? <laughs> I don't have a brother named Douglas. Lil Chrissy, like, what's up? Give Aunt Caddy a hug. Wah, okay, that's enough. I'm not even actually your aunt. Oh my god, can I talk to you about something? I guess. Actually, like anything though, your choice. I'm gonna say nothing. I don't want to talk to her. <laughs> you gotta go. Do you have, like, homework? You should, like, let me help. Haha, uh -huh, JK, I totally don't want to, ladies. Just like if you want to come in our cat flap is like always open to you okay thank you Ooh, it's you oh hi Chris did you need help with your homework again I know you were having trouble last time so um I actually got a few things ready for you in case oh uh, wait sorry I can't right now I forgot my house key again and sorry Chris I'll help you later if that's okay see you at school Chris um, Chris? Did you want to talk about something? Talk about Susie? Susie, that's right. You were with Susie. When you didn't come back to class, I was worried, but everything turned out okay, I think. Can I ask something if that's okay? Susie, I'm kind of curious what she's like, you know? I mean, who doesn't wonder about her? She never talks to anyone. So, Chris, could you tell me about her, if that's okay? She's nice. What? She's a nice person? Really? Like, really, honestly, truly. I mean, that's just what I was hoping, but... Wait, this isn't another trick, is it, Chris? Like when you put ketchup on your arms and told me it was blood? Really? You're serious? You're totally serious. Gosh, then maybe I should try talking to her. But if I die, you're paying for my funeral, Chris. Though, honestly, if she's nice, I might die too. <laughs> okay. <laughs> How do I get home to my mommy? Oh, this is my house. Okay, cool. Mom, I have flowers. Did you have fun, I guess? By the way, I just finished baking a pot. If you go to bed, it will be cool when you wake. 
but do not eat it all this time, all right? I have flowers for you. Chris, what is it? Flowers. Oh, Chris, flowers for your mother? How sweet. These are from him, are they not? Uh, well, worry not, Chris. I will find some place for them. What else can I talk to you about? Pie. Chris, since only you and I are living here right now, it feels just a bit lonely, does it not? But fortunately, sharing a warm, freshly made pie is the perfect cure for such a condition. As long as I get to eat some, of course. Oh, that's pretty cute. Can I eat the pie now? It's a butterscotch cinnamon pie and it's still cooling, I guess not. Well, I think that's kind of like the end of what we've got going right now. So this must be my brother's side. Look at how successful he is. He's got so many trophies and I have like nothing. It's kind of sad, I didn't really notice that before. Can I go in here yet? No. It's still me. Okay. Well, when this game is completely finished, then I'll be able to do a proper playthrough of it again. But I know that this chapter of your adventures will end. Will you go to bed? <gasps> you will sleep later. It's very interesting. I'm not sure how the new game style for Deltarune is going to be compared to Undertale. But I can already tell that the battles are harder. <laughs> For me, anyway. There's a lot of the same characters that were in Undertale. And then there's some new characters, too. Whether or not we will be able to go back to that closet room. or I don't know if that's going to happen, but... Yeah, so far the game has been really good, I think. Flush the toilet one more time. I will do that just for you. Where's the bathroom though? Is the bathroom downstairs? Oh yeah, it's in here. It's a toilet. Flush it. Yes. I did. <laughs> I should get a trophy for that, I swear. I don't even get to eat the pie yet. I'm so sad. So I think it's time for me to go to bed. In the game and in real life. So thank you guys for joining in. To stream with me I really appreciate it I'm sorry that I couldn't stream yesterday and I'm sorry that today is only an hour but we have managed to finish up what we can do so far in um, in Delta rune so I think that's pretty good and I hope that you guys enjoyed it and give me some suggestions on what kind of games you'd like me to see playing in my next streams because I have a few ideas but um, I would like to get more feedback and it doesn't matter if I don't have the game yet I'll still look into it and I plan to stream on my Friday, which is in a couple of days' time. So, yeah, hopefully I can do that. I should be able to. <laughs> but yeah, thank you for tuning in. I really appreciate it. And if you have any ideas for what you want me to do next time, then just let me know. Let's see if anything interesting happens. I think it's night time. That's pretty cute. I haven't seen a little graphic like this before. Wait, what? What's wrong with me? What's going on? Why am I a creepy zombie? Is this part of the game? It's my hand. What? I'm so confused. I have no idea what's happening. I know. I put my heart in a cage. Am I gonna go back to bed? 
this masochist? Yeah. Very interesting. Well, there you go. It looks like there's going to be a lot more to this game than what I originally thought. That's very weird. And the shadows start to grow. And the place that sounds like a cute outro. Seem like but I guess we'll just have to wait until the game's finished. I have no idea what that was or what that means. But um, we'll probably find out. I'll leave you guys on the stream with this music for a little while because I think it's pretty cute. But yeah, thank you so much for joining me and I'll see you guys on Friday to stream something else. I really appreciate it. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe if you want to support my channel. Thank you so much and I hope you guys have a good evening or day wherever you're from.